Hello friend, welcome to the abstract algebra class. It is class 8P. Uh, it is the final class of abstract algebra 1. Uh, we, here we want to prove this theorem and we will bring some example. A cyclic group of order n has phi of n generators. Here phi of n is Euler tuition function which is uh, we studied in number theory uh, Euler tuition function uh, it, uh, it, it is the, uh, the total number of uh, divisor of a number which is related to relatively prime to n if we say the number n <coughs> if proof let g be a cyclic group generated by an element element a and of order n that is g is equal to order of uh, cyclic group which is generated by a and order of g is equal to n we have to prove that the number of generators of g is equal to the tuition function Euler tuition function but previous theorem we knew that a to the power m m is a generate generator of g if and only if gcd m n is equal to 1 if and only if m is a positive integer less than n and relatively prime to n m is a positive integer less than m and relatively prime to n therefore the number of generators of g uh, is equal to the number of positive integers less than uh, less than n, n is equal to order of g and relatively prime to n it is equal to tuition function hence proof actually we prove that uh, the cyclic a cyclic group of order n has phi uh, of n generator, generators phi of n is a tuition regular tuition function here actually we prove that the number of generators of g is equal to p of n. Note that uh, this note related to the uh, Euler tuition function. Suppose p1 to the power alpha 1, p2 to the power alpha 2, and so on, p cap to the power alpha cap, where p1, p2, and so on, p cap are primes. Alpha 1, alpha 2, and so on, alpha cap are positive integers. Positive integers. Actually, we, how we can find phi uh, of uh, n? Phi of n uh, can find from, uh, from this formula in, into 1 minus 1 by pn into 1 minus 1 by 2n and so on 1 minus 1 by p cap. Example 1, let n equal to 60. Uh, if we decompose it, 60 as uh, 15 into 4 is it, it is equal to 3 to the power 1 and to 5 to the power 1 and to, to the power 2 p1 is equal to 3 here p2 is equal to 5 and p3 is equal to 2 we put these values in the formula of uh, Euler tuition function we get 16 and here in is 60 60 uh, into 1 minus 1 by 3 into 1 minus 1 by 5 uh, 1 into 1 minus by 2 it is equal to 60 into 2 by 3 into 4 by 5 and uh, into 1 by 2. If we um, multiply this, we get 60, 16. This implies uh, the number of divisor of 60 is equal to 16 is equal to 60 is equal to 16. Uh, it means there is 60 element, 16, 16 element which is less than 60. They are uh, relatively prime to 60. For example, 2 let n equal to 250, it is equal to uh, 5 cubic into 2. Here p1 is equal to 5, p2 is equal to 2. We get, we put this value in this formula, then we can get as 100. 100 means there is 100 element less than 250, uh, size that they are relatively prime to 250. Here is another example we want to uh, find. It is related to cyclic group. Uh, 
Actually, it is the formula of Euler tuition function. We can find p of n from this formula, as you see this, seeing these two uh, examples. Here, let another problem, let g is equal to a comma b comma c d, where a is equal to 1, 0, 0, 1, b is equal to matrix 0, 1, minus 1, 0, c is equal to minus 1, 0, 0, minus 1, and d is equal to 0, minus 1, 1, 0, and g is a group under matrix multiplication, prove that g is a cyclic group. We want to prove that this g is cyclic group. Given solution, given that g is equal to a comma b comma c comma d, where is a group under matrix multiplication. Multiplication. We are, we are, A is equal to 1, 0, 0, 1. B is equal to 0, 1, minus 1, 0. C is equal to minus 1, 0, 0, minus 1. D is equal to and D is equal to 0 minus 1 1 0 consider B belongs to B is equal to 0 B to the power 1 is equal to 0 1 minus 1 0 it is belongs to G B to the power 2 is equal to 0, 1, minus 1, 0, and to 0, 1, minus 1, 0, it is equal to 0 into 0, minus 1 into minus 1, into minus 1, minus 1, 0 into 1, 1 into 0, 0, minus 1 into 0, 0 minus 1, 0, 1 min minus 1 into 1, minus 1, it is equal to nothing but c b to the power 3 is equal to uh, minus 1 0 0 minus 1 into b b is equal to 0 1 minus 1 0 it is equal to minus 1 into 0 0 into minus 1 it is 0 minus 1 into 1 minus 1 0 into 0, 0, 0 into 0, minus 1 into minus 1, 1, 0 into 1, 0, minus 1 into 0, 0. It is equal to, hmm, from here, it is equal to D. B to the power 4 is equal to, uh, B to the power 3, B to the power 3, 0, minus 1, 1, 0 into 0, 1 minus 1, 0 it is equal to 0, 0 minus 1 into minus 1, 1 0, 0 1 into 0, 0, 0, 0 into minus 1, 0 1 into 1, 1 it is equal to A therefore G is equal to a comma b comma c comma d it is equal to and instead a we can write b to the power 4 b to the power 4 comma b comma and instead c we can write b square comma and instead d we can write b cubic or b to the power 3 It is equal to group view is generated by B. Therefore, G is, G is a 
cyclic group generated by by generated by B show that here is another example show that the set of all n root of unity with respect to multiplication is a cyclic group so let g be the set of all n uh, root of unity we know that g is equal to is, uh, omega to the power 0 omega to the power 1 and so on omega to the power n minus 1 where omega to the power q is equal to e to the power 2 k pi i by n k is equal to 0 1 and so 1 2 and so on n minus 1 we know that g is a group with respect to multiplication this is a group clearly omega to the power 0 is equal to 1 is equal to e identity element w e, e omega to the power 1 is equal to omega omega to the power 2 is equal to omega into omega and so on omega to the power n is equal to omega into omega and so on omega therefore every element of g can be written as sum of integral power of w omega omega therefore g is a cyclic group generated by omega g is equal to a to the power n size that n belongs to z g has these forms therefore this is a cyclic group we can say uh, this implies every element of g can be expressible as some integral power of a therefore actually we show that a uh, set of all n root of unity uh, under multiplication is a cyclic group here it is a cyclic group also uh, every element of g expressible as power of a hence solution of the problem Thank you.